So I'm getting down to more obscure characters. I've been showing you mostly obscure characters anyways, right? Okay. So, this guy's called Comcast. He's an X-Men X-Force villain. X-Men X-Force villain. He comes with a gun that fits into this holster right here. Hold on. Right here, see? Connected to his leg. It's so a, a gun, a, a silver gun. As you just put back in there. Fits very, very perfectly. He comes with this flying machine that is, his feet fit perfectly in there. His boots are silver, black, yellow, and brown. And, uh, and his face is like, he's like an Indian. He's like uh, an yeah, Indian skin guy. He's a bad guy. He's, uh, I don't know if he's a mutant, but I think Comcast is more of a... Uh, a technical guy. I liked him. I give him a 4.5 on 5. I don't know much about him, but you know what? To be honest, I don't care. I collect toys because I like how they look like. I don't collect them for sometimes that I have to give you every knowledge about every character. Sometimes some of the knowledge I don't know, but you know what? I know I, at least I know it's an X Men X Force figure from Toy Biz that came out in 1993. 1992, 93. And this was the X-Men X-Force line. Uh, I didn't see the Uncanny X-Men, it said X-Men X-Force. It was after first Uncanny X-Men started, then X-Men X-Force, and then so forth and so forth. And they made a lot of different other lines, like X-Men 2099, X-Men Generation X. They made X-Men Age of Apocalypse, X-Men Savage Land. Woo! So and so on and so on and so on. Plus Junkie out. Thank you for watching my short two-minute videos of X-Men from Toy Biz, X-Men X Force, X Force Comcast from Toy Biz. Stay plastic. Stay X-Men. More to come.